Pregnancy is a period of weakened immune state to prevent you from attacking your baby that has DNA that's foreign to you from the father. So by having that weakened immune state, women are much more susceptible to all types of viral infections. We've been talking about the flu for years. COVID's the new thing that we talk about. Pregnant women get very sick very fast and force us to make very difficult decisions about continuing a pregnancy versus delivering early. And unfortunately, we've had maternal deaths and preterm deliveries and fetal deaths and things that can only be explained by COVID. To date, the largest data set we have for pregnant women regarding the COVID vaccine is about 150,000 patients who were vaccinated at all different gestations of pregnancy. We haven't seen any increased risk of any pregnancy complications, no increased risk of birth defects, preterm deliveries, pregnancy losses, no complications at all. On the flip side, women in all gestations that are diagnosed with COVID, we're seeing all of those complications, preterm deliveries, maternal and fetal death, abruption, all kinds of complications. To date, we have no data to suggest any pregnancy complications from the COVID vaccine. There had been some concern, um, some misinformation that was published about the COVID vaccine causing infertility. There's no biologically plausible mechanism by which that could happen. We're not seeing any problems with conception. I have patients who've been vaccinated while trying to conceive three months before conception, six months before conception. We're not seeing any complications. I tell patients that come in that I understand their fear. I understand their concern. That's part of being a mom. I'm a mom myself but the single best thing that they can do, in my opinion, for the health and safety of their baby is to get vaccinated against COVID. We're in the middle of another huge spike. This probably won't be the last one. It's coming. You have to protect yourself, your baby, and the other children that you have at home, and you do that by vaccination.